hello guys and welcome back to moments with zion it's actually good to be back um if it's your first time of stopping by please you're welcome and if you're family already um i want to welcome you back and if you've not subscribed please take a moment and consider subscribing to this channel and after you subscribe you hit the notification bell that way you get um notifications every time that i upload a video so today guys i'm going to be talking about four things to look in a woman before you settle down with them women don't come for me <laughs> yeah four things to me four important things to look for in a woman before you settle down with them okay guys now the topic for today is a little bit different from what i've always talked about um my videos have been all about coronavirus the pandemic quarantine you know but today i'm drifting a little bit away from that and we're going to be talking about four things to look into a woman before you settle down with them so let's dive right into it all right so the first thing to look into the most important actually is to look for a woman that has the fear of god in them yes the god factor a woman that has a fear of god in them you know with a woman that has a fear of god in them you settle down with such a woman you know it, you know that that's, that's an easy woman to manage in the home. Studies have shown that. It is true. It's, a easy, it's easy to manage such a woman. Not just a Christian, okay? A woman that has, has a dynamic encounter, a relationship with the Lord Jesus Christ. The fear God. So, that's number one. And number two, you want to look for a woman that is submissive. A woman that's going to be submissive to you, Right? Now, the problem is not even just being submissive. The problem is submit, submission at all times. Submission at all times. Now, let me talk to ladies a little bit here. I just want to say that submission, okay, it's, it's, a, it's like a risk. You're taking a risk, ladies, when you're submitting to a man because you're supposed to submit to the man at all times. It's a risk you're taking because you don't know how this man is going to behave under pressure you don't know how they're going to behave when they don't have money you don't know how they're going to behave when they lose their job you just have to trust and be submissive right you don't go around talking about when they lose their job you don't go around talking about okay my man has lost their job i'm the only one that's bringing money to the home and then you lose your respect for your man and then your man becomes the becomes the talk of town you know you talk about him to your friends and all that and you talk talk to your friends tell your friends how your man is not good enough Wait, the last time I checked, the Bible didn't say we should be submissive only to a man that is good enough. Or you should be submissive only when things are rosy and good. You submit at all times. That is the risk you're taking, ladies. You just have to do your own part. And that's why on the video, previous video that, I, that I'm about to upload, I'm addressing the men, the ladies, what to look for in a man before you settle down with them. You look for a man that doesn't yeah has the fear factor the god fear factor in them but a man also that has oh that is submitted to an earthly authority that way when you do your part and the man is wayward or become something else there's a third person that they're going to be accountable to there's a third person that's going to hold them accountable there's a third person that they're going to that they, they're going to to face that's an earthly authority a man that doesn't have a a, a covering over them on this earth you marry that kind of a man, um, you've married trouble. Let me just put it that way. So back to you guys. The third thing, uh, uh, thing to look into a woman before you settle down with a woman is look for a woman that can sacrifice, a woman that is patient, a woman that is hospitable, okay? A woman that can inconvenience themselves to build their home. When you guys are courting, when you guys are dating, you're going to see those threats. You're going to see those, those, these things, these tips that I'm giving you. You will see them. If you pay attention, you will see them. Okay. Look for that woman that is patient. Look for that woman that is sacrificial. Look for that woman that is hospitable. A woman that is meek. A woman that, you know what I'm talking about. Let me not just dwell on that. All right. So the last um, thing to look into in a woman that you want to settle down with is to me, um, this is not really, um, well, I just added this one on there because of the, of the men, because I will sit here and lie if I don't tell you that men, they look out for this a woman that is, of course, physically attractive, the physical factor, not just the face, but the, 
You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but on this, I'm going to say, you don't just want to look for a woman that has all these physical look, good looks and all that, and then you forget what their character is. Look for a woman that has, is as beautiful inside as much as they are beautiful outside. A woman that will call you their king. Let me put it that way. But you also have to play your own part. You have to play your own part. You have to love them. Anyways, we'll talk about that on my video that I'm going to be addressing. The four things to look for in a man before you settle down with them. So, guys, that's all that I had to say um, in this video. Four things to look for in a man before you settle down with them. Or, I mean, four things to look for in a lady before you settle down with them. This, this video was actually for our brothers. So, ladies, I have a video for you guys. Um that I've made, I've not yet uploaded that video, is addressing the four things that you have to look into before you settle down with a man. And I promise you're going to enjoy that video. I will upload that video very soon. Now, I hope that you were able to learn something in this video. If you're a man out there that is looking at settling down anytime soon, I hope these four factors that I just mentioned, you were able to learn something, um, implement them. Look, when you go out there looking for a woman, try to look for this, you know, for this traits in them if you're calling a woman right now look for this trait in them it will be obvious it will it will be obvious because it's not when you've married a woman and then you you start or something goes wrong and then you start regretting oh my god why did i just marry you know so if you're watching this video count yourself lucky that you're watching this video okay do not make a mistake before you settle down at least and if you're a man that you've already settled down with maybe you're thinking the wrong partner or there's nothing like a wrong partner if something is going on wrong then you the man labor in the place of prayer you need to labor in the place of prayer and you the man like i said before we, we, you expect all these things from a woman but you yourself you have to play your own part you have to be responsible and i, I need to let you know that responsibility is like a burden it's like a burden of obligation to somebody or to something or to let me say your wife that you marry it's, a, it's, it's, like an, it's like a burden of obligation. You have no choice but to, you're obligated, all right? So, oh well, like I said, we'll address that in my next video, okay? So, I just want to take the time to thank, to thank you once again for watching this video so far. If you're still watching, it means that you are learning something from this video. And so, therefore, do not forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. That way you get notifications every time I upload a video like this or I upload future videos, okay? So thank you guys for watching. Thank you for your time. You stay strong, stay healthy, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.